people tend to overestimate and also underestimate success and failure, I find. Did any of you see Mark Wahlberg's uh, recently published daily schedule, which involves getting up at 2.30 in the morning and after praying for half an hour, working out his first workout of the day and uh, a whole series of meals throughout the day and um, cryogenic chambers and a little bit of time for family and uh, family and returning business calls. I'm not sure how that actually works when he's making a movie, but um, I always respect people who work hard and I always want to work hard so I was kind of attracted to it initially but I realized that um, I have no desire to get up at 2.30 in the morning and I have a pretty good schedule organized for myself already where I I'm able to balance my health which I think is very important because without your health you really have uh, no ability to enjoy the other aspects of life that are important so I, I don't mean I mean optimal health for every individual and I have, um, so my schedule is something along the lines of I'm up at seven, I watch TVO and have a protein shake with my four year old, I'm uh, at my desk at 7.30, eat my breakfast, reading what I need to read, uh, organizing myself for the day, I'm out the door at 8.30, I'm running hills or in the gym until about 10, I'm a second protein shake, I'm back at my desk, I uh, I shower in there somewhere. I'm I uh, I work until noon hour, uh, investigating stocks, trading stocks, communicating with the people I need to communicate with. I generally eat my lunch at my desk. I continue the activity of the business activity that I'm describing through the course of the afternoon. Perhaps have a snack around three o'clock. Finish up around six. Uh, hit the barbecue and barbecue some aspect of dinner and then it's uh, 7 30 I've got my four-year-old in bed and uh, I'm reading to him uh, dog man and then I spend some time with my older sons and my girlfriend watching uh, whatever the most recent exciting TV series is and then I read and I, I actually spend most of my day reading. I, I, you know, Warren Buffett talks about reading 500 pages a day, and uh, I try to I try to read a lot during the day, both newsworthy things, financial statements, company reports, uh, macroeconomic materials, and classic stuff as well. Anyway, I read from about 11 to 11:30, and then it's off to sleep and repeat.